and twice the wise with another video for all of you. So uh, I was surfing through YouTube um, today and I found this video. Uh, it was a video by Presh Talwalker, you probably know him. He is a math genius, he solves a lot of tough problems. So this is an SAT problem. It's an easy solve and I got it, the answer was 3. In the video, Presh Talwalker says that the answer is 3, but he uses another method to prove that the answer should be 4. Well, I'm going to use his method, Presh Talwalker's method, and prove him wrong, contradict his proposal, and say that the answer stands as 3, cannot be 4. So let's go on with the proof. Here you go. If circle A starts at the top and I carefully roll it around circle B, after one quarter of the distance, circle A is already revolved around one time. So just like him, I took cardboard cutouts of two circles, the bigger one being 15 centimeters in diameter. So 15 by 2 is 7.5 and hence the bigger circle's radius is 7.5 centimeters. Now the smaller one has a diameter of 5 centimeters. So 5 by 2 is 2.5 and the radius is 2.5 centimeters. And we know that 7.5 by 3 is 2.5. So yeah. So now what I'm going to do is align both circles and uh, take a scale, a ruler, and draw a line that passes uh, through both uh, circles. So yeah, so we can use this as a point of reference, like the starting point uh, for our uh, experiment of sorts. Now I'm going to rotate the smaller circle uh, along the circumference of the bigger one as we uh, revolve around it. So uh, yeah, there it goes. And Yep, so the point, uh, the, the line is going to reach, yeah it has reached, so this would be, this would mark the first uh, rotation, so one circumference is complete. Now the reason I'm using these markings is to uh, tell you that the circumference, I mean the rotation isn't complete until the line comes in contact with the biggest circle. So right now, uh, the circumference that is the rotation number two is complete and as we go to the final lap uh, yeah so now the line will approach the starting point if it does and yes it does so now we can see that uh, three complete uh, rotations are complete you know so from the starting point to the first marking we have the first rotation then from the first marking to the second, we have the second rotation. Now from there to the starting point, we have the third one, so that makes three. Yeah. Now guys, look at the word circle A. It's horizontal and upright. So after one-fourth of the journey, the word also becomes horizontal again. So this is where Presh Talwalker made, made a mistake because even in my case, the numbers 2.5 centimeter uh, becomes horizontal and upright after one fourth of the journey, as you can see here. Yeah, but the smaller circle does not complete the revolution. I'm sorry, rotation. Yeah, that is where Presta Walker made a mistake, I think. <laughs> Alright Trash, um, I don't mean any disrespect, it's just for fun. Uh, you're still a genius, I love your videos. Alright guys, my viewers, please like and subscribe. Um, I haven't been uploading a lot lately, but from next week onwards, I'll be uploading quite frequently, so watch out for more great content. I'm going to be uh, teaming up with my friends and you know giving you guys a blast, so watch out for me. I'm always here, twice the wise, signing off. See ya, pals. See ya, pals. <laughs>